trying to have a look at the date, but I can't. Oh. Well, it first published in 1997, but it says here um, in 1938 it was another book under the title of Costume and Fashion, Volume 3, The Tudors, Book 1 and 2. So I wonder if this was it. Oh, yeah, Dover edition. So this, so this, oh, it said right here, look, welcome to the Dover edition. <laughs> it says here, Herbert Norris was a scholar in the generation of the 20th century universalists enamoured for of history as a pageant. His rich, visually expressive volume, Tudor Costume and Fashion, takes its title from its predilection for the extravagant panorama associated with costume and the special circumstances and evolution that connote fashion. And it goes on and on um, by this guy, Richard Martin, who is the creator of the Metropolitan Museum of Art. And this looks 1617. So here we go, a forward. It says something in Welsh. Anglesey, the cradle of the Tudors. Interesting. So then we have contents. It's very text heavy. And then it goes into all the black and white uh, illustrations, as you can see. And then chapter one, the reign of King Henry VIII. We do have a map. So, yeah, as you can see, there is um, black and white drawings here. And um, it's obviously talking about the hoods, I think, yeah, look, the headdresses. So we do have lots of um, black and white illustrations to break up the text, which is quite nice. Look at this. It shows you how put it on like that, and then that's like that. Interesting. That looks very much like the hood of one of those models I showed you. So it goes into men as well. Look at that feather. And then, yeah, there's lots of that. Um, it said, back there, human of the guard. So not only does it talk about royal royalty and what they would wear, but you know, the general person, I mean, Queen Elizabeth, look how they spell Elizabeth. That one's very fancy. I wonder if these stopped you hearing. Um, Coloured, it says, King Henry the Seventh and Queen Elizabeth. So that was U Elizabeth of York. So, yeah, it's it's a chunky monkey, an absolute gold mine. So here we are. Um, I don't know why my camera is making it look a bit dark, but it's quite bright. So here we are. We have got the stunning illustrations at the bottom here, as you can see. We have got... Um, the index and yeah we all know who that is don't we this looks like the Anna Cleves so we go there we go there's that triangle shape and over the page we have the other ones coming into Elizabeth the first but then we go on to Baroque so we just literally just have two pages of the Tudors because one um, obviously love Tudor clothes but um, I was going to teach myself to sew but I just I just never got around to it 
you'll have to bear with because um, where I'm recording from I, I'm very limited with space but look at these I mean gorgeous gorgeous and it does go into um, this where it's like line art drawing of ordinary people's clothing and clothing of the elite which I think is really interesting to see the difference there is of course similarities but um, well you can tell you can just tell by looking So in these pages, it shows you here a pattern, shows you how to put them on and make them, etc. So yeah, that. There. This next book is rather larger and again, it's not of all again it's not just Tudors it's everyone but what I really like is these big big black and white drawings and then you get a bit of the information so let's find the Tudors I've got Henry the seventh and I'm guessing that is supposed to be Elizabeth of York I mean look at that look at that line there's sleeves it's absolutely gorgeous gives you notes on patterns for the men for the women i've often thought about coloring these in actually but just never got around to it so then you go to the next page and it gives you the patterns i think it's amazing there we go henry the eighth not a young one this must be uh catherine And then we have uh, Edward the Sixth. Is this Mary? And then we have Elizabeth the First. So these four books are ones I have on costume, and I really enjoy them that I really enjoy on uh, costume and fashion. I hope you enjoyed um, this video showing you them. Thanks for watching and I will see you again very soon with another video. Bye bye.